welcome to my channel today we are gonna make a video on the request of darshani's darshani solanki create a new order date example if current year is 2023 and then make sure new order date should have 2023 and show the below column in the tags all right so without any further delay let's get it started and uh, first what was our condition as you can see in the screen first we have to create a new order date so as you know we i already uh, had created my new order date because i'm using same data all the time so many time i have shown in my video that how we can create a new order date i will just simply drag this into the column cell from there i will use quarter month sorry year quarter and month all right then uh, calculated field one first we will create for the year as you can see by the name of years to create a year filter we will just use year and order date order date we have already right and just click ok same like that we have to create month and month and uh, what you call quarter wise also then we will create one more calculated field uh, for the quarter as you can see quarter we will use date part function yeah and i will select in the quarter we will write the name of quarter here comma and what we need here from order date from order date we will cal calculate the quarter right oh, sorry i have written this wrong let me do it again date part i will use quarter here and then order date that's it for same like that we will create one more calculated fit for the month create calculated fit i will write name month okay same date part filter we will use here sorry the function we will use here we will write in month comma from order date right so now we will create three more calculated fit mtd ytd and qtd what is mtd mtd is in month to date cells we will create and then water to date cells then year to date cells first we will create one more calculated field by the name of mtd so you can write like here mtd say for that we will use if function if dated if is month and we will get it from order date and today today we as you know we use this function and then is equal to zero sorry zero and year from where we want order date right here also we want from order date order date will close the bracket is equal to year today today year from the today date we will open the bracket we will write today close the bracket then as we know already if function always with the logic right and we will close with the end so yeah this is our cal calculated field as you can see in the screen so we will just click ok same like that we will create two more calculated field now we will create one more calculated field by the name of QTD. Okay, means quarter to date sales. Quarter to date. I will write in the capital. It will look better. QTD sales. Right. I will. We will use same if function. I am directly writing this to save our time. So yeah, we can save some time. You know, uh, while I am writing the formula, it take too much time. So you can pause the video and you can write write accordingly all right so this is our calculator filter for the qtd all right okay so this is the uh, function we uh, sorry lod we will use for the ytd so you can pause here also and you can write it okay now our old calculated field has been created now we will just drag and drop and our answer will be there all right so let me hide this first then it will look more better all right so first what i will do i will select from here month into the text column 
quarter into the text column and here also into the text column and from here I will select white same month MTD cells also here YTD cells also here and QTD right you can adjust according to you so this is our answer here so as you can see here this is our new order date for 2023 all right so we already drag it here and 2022 2021 if you will drag a little bit more or if you want you can keep it here also it's all up to you i would suggest you can keep it like that if you want you can keep it here then you, it will be more visible for everybody right like that so you can see the cells according to the quarter wise this is a month wise quarter and if you will go to uh, drag down a little bit uh, change it to the dimension it will show you that dimension wise it's all up to you so i hope this uh, answer is satisfied you so as you can see here the 2023 in the last and 2022 and 2021 and 2020